Okay, so I made a previous video about the dividends getting paid out, but I was crazy, ridiculously excited, and I thought, you know what, you got to temper that down a little bit because you never know what's going to happen. Basically, we ended up getting over over TR, uh, two, two TRX per token, which cost, if you were mining properly, you, being conservative, it should have cost you about one TRX to mine one token, which means everyone who were able to get near the actual mining cost of one TRX, um, everyone made profit in TRX. Like you made 200% more than what you had in TRX, um, plus you got to keep your free tokens, of course. Uh, you're not free tokens, but you kept your tokens. Well, they were essentially free because you withdrew 2X. Um, so I had like, I've, I've frozen a few because I was playing, but I had uh, just over 3,000. I got divs of a little over 6,000. Um, and I froze some, and I already froze some, and uh, and then I got these 3,600 left in my wallet right now. Um, where do I think it's going to go from here? It's hard to say. I mean, I think they did a lot of things right. Let me tell you, that dividend payout was one of the smoothest I've seen. With the glitches that the website had early on launch, I was nervous. They only do div payouts at the end of every stage, which I think is probably good. It prevents people from, you know, constantly trying to dump and everything else on the token, which is good, but still gives people a chance to unfreeze and sell in a reasonable fashion in the middle of the stage if they want to. Stage one went really fast. I think the other stages are going to start to slow down. Um, that's that's what I think. I don't know. We'll have to wait and see. Although although <laughs> we got that dip payout, I mean, what hour hour and a half ago, and we're already at fifty seven thousand TRX. So I don't know. It's gonna be it's gonna be interesting. Um, we'll see what happens when we go through this round. Clearly, we're gonna start getting diluted right now, and uh, and and they've got a ways to go to to for this TRX to catch back up to where you're getting one TRX per PKT. I don't know. I think that might be possible this round. We'll have to wait and see what happens. Um, it's going to depend on how fast, how much people play too. Like how long. I, I do see a point where this is not a miners game at all because you're not getting paid out every day. You can't auto mine, which I think is good for the, the player base, which is ultimately what every single one of these dApps need to focus on. They need to focus on the players not the miners, um, but it could be a consistent earner. It's just going to pay out periodically through the stages. Um, so we'll just have to kind of wait and see how it goes. When I say consistent, I meaning it can it can be a good earner for us um, if you've got patience, um, which is what it's going to take long term. So that's that's going to be good. We're already at two percent. We may mine through stage two. We'll have a better idea. I feel like once stage two finishes and we see what the dividends are. It's going to be easier to calculate kind of what we should be able to earn between each stages. That's going to be a little bit more accurate than trying to figure out where you would normally earn like every day. Because every day, for example, um, Dutron. Dutron did awesome last night. I got uh, just over 100 TRX. Well, it looks like I'm going to have over 100 tonight as well. Um, yesterday, though, Dutron started out super slow. Uh, the day before yesterday, I had got 300 TRX. The day before that, I only got like 40 or 50. It was nothing. Um, and so there's, there's a lot of ups and downs. Neutron is kind of an interesting earner too. The good thing about that one is you can't really auto mine it. And hopefully that's going to be kind of an indication of how Pokertron is going to do since you can't auto mine it. And it's very much player centric um, overall. So we'll be able to see. It's going to be interesting too. Once these two, um, once these two jackpots hit, It'd be interesting to see how mining does after or playing does after that. Does playing drop off? Do people keep playing? I mean, it's interesting. People are, are still playing. We're almost, you know, an hour or two after the payout, we're almost to 50,000 Tron without auto mining, mind you. These are actually organic players playing. So if you want to know how to play Poker Tron, if you want to know how to mine the Poker Tron token, be sure to check out my playlist. I'll put uh, this video at the very end of the playlist just because it was the very first dividend payout. Um, and the only thing, other thing I plan to add to the playlist for the most part after that is new developments. But we had the first dividend payout. Just to tell you kind of how it went down, I was watching this. It went to 99.99%. I kept watching, kept watching, and then all of a sudden, this bar dropped. It went down to 0%. This number here stayed really high. I forget what it was. It was way up there in the millions, right? I think, and then all of a sudden, it dropped, and I didn't see anything happening. I thought, did we get paid? So I went and clicked on my... Uh, account and I didn't see anything in my wallet. I didn't see anything getting paid. So then 
I click back. When I click back, I saw the balance sitting right here, and literally click withdraw. It went straight to the to my wallet. It was extremely smooth. The whole thing looked like it only took four or five seconds at, at the most. The website didn't appear to glitch at all, um, which was very very encouraging because I was nervous about that first payout, especially with the way that this thing went down originally. Um, just to recap, this is Pokertron on the Tron network. This video will be part of the playlist I have that teaches how to play, po uh, how to play video poker as well as uh, different betting strategies. Now, if you're mining, you're just going to do a straight consistent bet. But I do have some alternative strategies if you like to do a little bit of you know gambling. Keep in mind, you should not be playing this at all if gambling is not legal in whatever jurisdiction you you live in, or if you know that you have some sort of a gaming problem, a gambling problem, you definitely should stay away. Um, Wait until the token goes on an exchange somewhere. It hasn't went on an exchange yet. It might be now. Nope. Let's refresh the page. I don't see it. Nowhere. All right. That's it for now. Wait, was that it? Nope. That's it for now. Have a great day. Have a great weekend.